how is everybody doing out there today? It is 4, uh, let's see, 4.30 a.m., 8-9-2020. The sleeping giant is about to be awakened, and that is Apollo Currency APL. It's brother GSX coming at you full speed ahead. And with the stuff that's coming up this week, get ready. Knock, knock, knock. Wake up. Here we go. To the market, you've got 355 billion and 14.8 for the daily. BTC at 11.695. ETH at 3.94. XRP, everything's holding steady, right? The best way to put it. Look at a graph, sideways motion, some uptick for the ETH to come back from its downturn, and the market's holding at that 350-ish. So. We will watch it and see what happens. Speaking of that, with the Apollo FinTech products that are out there and the thing that you have coming up, I featured the um, national payment platform video in bits in the national currency, uh, I should, should say bank platform um, in bits, but um, getting the full video coming um, that has a different voiceover and music, a little more entertaining. And I will f feature that because it's basically this is complex um, programming to a degree, but it shows you the full aspect of what the government can use and the consumer and the businesses. So it's really good just to show you what Apollo's got. And that is coming. I'm going to feature the whole video, um, which is 10 minutes long, but it's good. It's well worth it. So with the stuff that's happening this coming week, You've got a lot of stuff happening with the United Allied States. Uh, you have a lot of stuff happening with all different areas of the products that they have coming and more and more. Okay, so we will watch it and the breaking news will happen. And you can't forget that the inauguration of the first president of the United Allied States is happening on Saturday this coming week. New York regulator fast tracks 10 cryptocurrencies. XRP is on that list along with a few others that you know, of course, all the ones that have been around forever. South Korea's largest bank unveils Bitcoin custody services. Good for them. This quantum computing breakthrough is one of the breakthroughs for quantum computing, including uh, Apollo's <laughs> quantum steel. Excuse me. And Mr. A.M. is hiccuped. Okay, so with the quantum steel, and different things that are happening around the world. People are trying to protect against quantum. And Apollo's right there with the quantum steel. And this one here is also working on it. So we'll have to see how they do. But we know that you got to do it because quantum is a threat. No doubt about that. The SEC is changing the scene for institutional traders. This is big. With the SEC changing the requirements for the 13F form um, for filing, it used to be $100 million for the um, institu institutionals. Now it's, what is it, $13 billion, I think it is? Let me go down here. No, no, excuse me, $3.5 billion. Still a huge number difference from $100 million to $3.5 billion. So it's a big difference for the institutional investors, and a lot of them will not have to file. Nice there. United Allied States first fully uh, blockchain government. This article, I'm going to list it down below. Okay, this gives you a good breakdown of what Apollo FinTech is doing with the UAS, Enhancing Government Efficiency via Tech. One stop service for the convergence of government departments, civil registration, secure payment method, all Apollo center, Central basically, um, along with everything that they're doing, land registration, open government. Identity management. This one I will list down below. Filing of tax returns, eliminating bloat in government, Apollo. Protection of data, Apollo. Everything is here, and you've got to read this because it's a really good breakdown of the UAS. Okay, especially the people that are not informed about the UAS and they're talking about rapture and new world order. Uh, these things will clarify, including the fact page. And with a fact page, now the UN, it is, they're not part of the UN now, okay, but will they, down the road, maybe, 
Okay, this one says no, but Steve has said maybe. So he, he's the president, don't forget. <laughs> President-elect, but he is saying that, the, you know, it's a possibility. Um, but keep in mind, too, you know, right now there's no lands disclosed to the world. So people are going, oh, okay, well, you know, what's going to happen? What, you know, just be patient because these deals with these countries that are giving land to the United Allied States as states that will be joining in together as a nation, this thing that is happening is history being made in the world. And the first state to be announced is a beautiful place with beaches and gorgeous uh, landscaping and the thing is it's part of the UAS first one and then you have three more that are lined up and then there are more coming using the Apollo Fintech products and the national currency of the GSC with no inflation hosted on Apollo's network yeah and paper money included yes uh, so all this here is on the UAS government agency website and you got to look at all the rights that you have as part of it. And what the thing is, once you get educated, you're going to get excited. That's the best way to put it. Apollo Fintech articles are out there, the most complete blockchain ecosystem. Check them out. I mean, they're all over. There's a list that I showed in Apollo Marketing. They're taking care of business and getting the word out there. So now people will say, well, when is APL going to be, you know, mainstream noticed and all that? Ladies and gentlemen, it's been two and a half years and people are saying, well, when? Guess what? It's about to happen. You have all this marketing going on. You have all these products coming out. And when you look at the history being made for the world events, Zimbabwe, CBZ, MOA, this national payment platform and a commodity exchange that Apollo is giving to the government, is all going to be active and the people of Zimbabwe are going to be so much better off for it. The United Allied States, when you hear the states being announced and you see all of it come into reality, it's all there. There are teams going out to sign other countries using the national payment platform. Gold Inc, social ecosystem, so much more coming, so much more that's going to be breaking news. Get ready to rock. ApolloCurrency.com is where you get the wallet for the APL, which is still less than a penny. Can you believe it? It's ground floor opportunity. You have an all-in-one wallet when you download it that has a DEX in it built in, which you can use a Paxos stablecoin to send to your bank. It has a marketplace. It has forging for free coins. It has so much. Check it out. Download it. Use the web wallet. It's very secure. Why? Because it gives you an account number and a passphrase. Do not share the passphrase. The account number, you can log in from the desktop, mobile, web, done. You can log in. But the passphrase, if you give it up, share it, then you have a chance of losing your coins. To keep it private, you are good to go. Everybody have a great one. Any breaking news, I will have it. And remember this, the link is down below for the GSX is the world's first stable growth coin. It provides its owners with the benefits of absolute value while also facilitating growth over time. There is no stable coin on the market that does what a, this one does. And this stable coin is not going up, excuse me, not going down, but it's going up. And when you think about this, you see that blow horn over to the right here? Yep, 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 yep. So many people are going to be going, holy mackerel, watch this. Can you believe it? Because there's going to be a dashboard that you have in the palm of your hand on your phone. And you can watch or your desktop. Take your pick. Okay? And you can watch this stuff happen. With the reinvesting, this price of this GSX is going up and up and up. So with that, it's four and a half cents. And you get, right now, only four and a half cents. And you get 65% free using that link down below in the description. Everybody, get ready to rock. Big stuff happening, and I can't wait. I really can't wait. I've said that before. Guess what? This one's really going to be the bomb.